Tuesday morning, almost 11. We just had a nice breakfast here on Susha Island, north of Orcas in the San Juans. <laughs> One of our favorite spots from, well, 15 years ago when we first started coming up here. Lots of nice little bays and coves. <clears throat> we had a rocky, windy night last night out there on the end buoy. And the gal said, that's enough. And pointed toward this little quiet bite here at the end of the cove, and it worked out fine. We had about uh, four feet of clearance at low tide. We had a little wind change, and that drifted us over, and we bumped a rock last night. Or I should say early this morning, about five. So we had to adjust the lines. And Okay. Yeah, go ahead and I'll get a picture of you on the way to shore. Yeah, you can go ahead and aren't you? If they'll let me. Yeah, they said, yeah. yeah we'll just let him hang on to the outside. <laughs> star bright, starlight, who's sh navigating this ship tonight? Mm -hmm. Did you punch in the right coordinates to get to shore? <laughs> uh, I think I did. Looking down into Fossil Bay at our two little yachts. Mine is waiting in lonely anchor at uh, Jones Island. We're going to take a little stroll around the other two coves here. Echo and Shallow, Shallow Bay and See what they might hold for future anchorages. Well, that's a pretty, pretty picture. Framed nicely. Sure, wish I could have thought to get my camera out last night and at least record the sounds of these two owls. They'd call back and forth to each other. One was about a third of an octave off key from the other one, but it didn't uh, inhibit their pitching a little woo at our expense for about an hour. It was cute, though. <laughs> That's looking down the end of Fossil Bay and out the opening. And another little cove over there in Shallow Bay. We went over this morning early and tried to try our luck with some clams. There's a lot of horse clams and down there so deep and the mud was so heavy and thick that it was just a point was to without a clam shovel to get them. I want to see my cardiologist. <laughs> We're out of shape. We just took a little one mile hike across the island and we're ready for the paramedics. <laughs> you didn't mention that it was straight up hill. <laughs> we needed it though. Well, this, was the same right this is Echo Bay. Oh, you bet. That's, that's the direction the wind was whistling in. Yesterday afternoon and evening. So the trail must go off up there. Probably goes all the way out to the point. That other trail said that it went out to this point out here. Oh. Well, this is Shallow Bay. 
on the western side of Susha, where we probably should have dropped anchor last night. The wind was south by southeast. And this has got sort of a northwesterly exposure, and it's really calm. <coughs> but right now, the wind is coming in from that direction, so you never know. This little Two, island has more coves. Three, four, five, six, <laughs> it looks like Tommy's in the jaws of a massive dragon or a... I don't know whether uh, I detect a fossil inside of that thing or not. Could be. Is Tommy a fossil? I may have to edit this out before I show it. <laughs> In the interest of family harmony. <laughs> You're in the wrong bay, Tom. <laughs> the fossils are supposed to be over yeah. there. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> out there on that point and see what we can see? No. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it all from here. We saw it from out there. Huh. Yeah, we saw it from the other side, Donna. Two. She looks kind of pretty there. <laughs> Waiting Good for evening. us. Just coming back from our Honey, two day. Mm -hmm. We're right now at two hundredths of a, a mile trip up off. around northern Orcas. Sushi well, Patos. We're two hundredths of a mile off right now. Oh, no. I get over and there. how much is two hundredths of a mile? Two hundredths of a tenth or two tenths of two one hundredths. That's not two tenths. Two one hundredths? Jones Island uh, deer population seems to be very tame. We brought some bread to see if they'll eat out of our hands. Does Calamity want a pet? Take him home with us? Over. <laughs> huh? Turn around and look here. <laughs> and you reach out and pet me and then don't feed me. That's <laughs> terrible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do they do it? I am sorry. I'm She's got a competitor coming up. Did you see that little buck over on the other side? Yeah. Oh, was there? Uh -huh. Oh, yes. Yeah. The little spiker. Uh -huh. Little spike. 
that? <laughs> you get it? No. I can't get my zoom to zoom. Well, I'll push the button on the back. <laughs> <laughs> Tippy toes. Well, we just stopped in for a moment or two here at uh, West Sound. Deer Harbor Marina and the county dock here to get some groceries. And then we're going to go to Skull Island for tonight. I haven't decided whether to eat here at the little deli or cook tonight, so we'll make up our minds depending on what the store has to offer. Cereal. We just made reservations for 7.30 this evening and got an anchorage here just below the mansion, the famous Moran Mansion. Uh, there's Edward. And the old toad, I believe, is just off my starboard there. Kayakers. It's a great place. A lot of history here. Famous shipbuilder. Built this great mansion with a famous pipe organ that he had brought in from Europe. And <laughs> and she's a star. Oh, dinner is at 8.30. Do you need a ride in? Oh. Yes. Okay. 8.30? 8.30. Uh, there it is. We can get it. Come here. Newburgh, Newburgh yeah, Oregon people here. It was a dead giveaway. <laughs> I told her. This is the harbor, interior harbor here at Rosario. Not very big. You've got to have reservations way in advance to get into the real protected spot here. We're short noticers, so we didn't get in, but I think we'll be all right. It's pretty calm out there, too. Looks like it. All glory in the breeze. Probably about 1936 model. Huh. What did you say, Ed? About 1936 model. I don't know. Referring to that old. You know, that looks an awful lot like that yellow wood ship coming into harbor here. It's bigger. Yeah, I believe you're right. It's longer, but it's not as uh, 